again, YouTube. Well, happy Halloween, and welcome back to my Super Mario 64 walkthrough. I mean, playthrough, whatever, whatever you want to call it. I don't care. It's Halloween. Call it whatever you want. Um, yeah. So, uh, in case you don't know already, I am the one and only Bubba Bricks, and this is going to be part five of my playthrough. So yeah, uh, I'm back with, with a new video. And yeah, I'd just like to say happy Halloween to everyone. So, um, who's dressing up? And, well, I mean, by the time this is up already, everyone's going to be done trick-or-treating. So, um, so what did you dress up as? And if you didn't, what did you do during Halloween? In fact, here's another question. What is your favorite candy? It could be chocolate, sugar, or you could ask just out of all of them. I just gotta say that my favorite, all time favorite candy is nerds. You know the Wonka nerds that come in the box? All those are great. Just, you just pour them, you just pour them in your mouth and they're absolutely fantastic. It's just like a party going inside your mouth, on inside your mouth. Okay, so anyways, um, I don't remember where we were last time, but you know what I'm going to do? Since it is... Oh, wait, no. Oh, that's no fair. Okay, so you see, since it was a Halloween episode, I wanted to do um, the course uh, Booze Haunted Mansion, because that's like a spooky kind of course. But, unfortunately, I can't do it right now, because I think you need more stars to do it, so... Oh, that's gonna be a problem. You know what, let's just continue on with uh, Jolly Roger Bay, like we did last time. <laughs> Anyways, um, I, I watched my last video, part four, um, and I saw the camera angle throughout, like, the whole video, and I thought, man... I really screwed that up. It's just terrible. Like, I had it down the first or second, third video, but the fourth video, I just got worse at putting an angle on the TV. So this time, I really made sure I had a good angle on here. So, I hope by the time this goes up and I look at the angle, it's good enough. Otherwise, I don't know what to say. Alright, so anyways, um, I've noticed that I haven't really been collecting that many stars, and I've actually been failing a lot, and I don't go back to the stars, so I'm going to try to do that less. I'm going to try to actually get the stars more and try harder. It's not that I'm, it's not that I'm terrible at this game, and it wasn't just because of the playing, I'm bad at playing games at night thing, it was that... Well, I bet many, many game commentary people think so. That whenever you're playing a game, you're getting caught up on commentary and playing the game at the same time. And it's just a little bit too stressful, so. Yeah, so that's probably why I haven't been doing so good on this. I'll try to focus more on uh, playing the game, but of course I'll still focus on commentary, so. Yeah. So if I sound boring, well, you're just going to have to deal with it. It's either the gameplay or the commentary. Alright, so I just got to wait for this eel to come out of the ship. Which, I don't even know how that's decided. Uh, I don't know how anything's decided. Oh, never mind, he's out. Alright, so let's try this again. I t failed miserably last time. Oh, okay. Well, I got it this time. Ah, come on. Open. Oh, shockified. Ah. Oh, anyways, I'd just like to say, um, uh, now I have like a total of, uh, 29 subscribers, and of course, like I said before, most of them are my friends, but about like four of them are actually people I don't know. So like they're actual subscribers. So um, whoever subscribed to me, um, I just like to say thank you. 
I don't. I can't even tell who some of my subscribers are because YouTube says it only shows the, the the only subscribers or people it shows in your subscribers are the people who keep their subscriptions public. So uh, I don't actually know who some of my subscribers are, but I don't really care as long as I know that you're subscribed and thank you for that. It means a little bit to me. I mean, like it means a lot, but. It's just 29, so. I mean, it's not like I'm trying to get subscribers, but it's still good to have subscribers. Like, people who care about you and admire whatever what you do for other people. Subscribers are like, you know, subscribers are like followers or just admirers, what I think. People who care about your your work, your content, your um, responsibility to do it. Like, that's what I think. That's just my point of view. Other people just see subscribers as people that, I don't know, like, like, um, let's see who gets the highest subscriber amount. Oh, that guy has a big subscriber amount. He must be, like, so famous. He must be doing all this for the fame. This, really, that makes me sick. Alright, so, anyways, let me focus more on the game right now. Alright, so, um, yeah, all you had to, I should have been saying, all you have to do is get the treasure chest in the right order and just climb these steps and don't slip down. That's all you have to do. Oh, okay, so that's our ninth star. My ninth star. I mean, if you want to share stars, sure. Oh, and, uh, but... <laughs> By the way, um, this is probably going to be the first episode that you hear me eating something because, um, I mean, I can't just, I can't just not join in on the Halloween spirit. So while I, like, while I'm, uh, playing this and recording this, uh, I have a bag of peppermint yonk patties right next to me and I'm going to be eating some of those. And I'm going to make all of you little children starve. So, enjoy being hungry. <laughs> I mean, I'm just kidding. Well, I mean, like, not about eating the yawns, but, like, making you hungry. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry if I'm making you hungry or something. But, you know, I'm, I'm hungry, too. I'm just gonna eat. In fact, um, I should tell you that I'm recording this at, like, 8. I don't know. I, I don't know why I always say that when, when I'm recording it. Just to let people know what it's what, like, what time it is, or how I feel or what I'm doing. Uh, I'm recording this at 8 at night on a Thursday. And um, the reason I'm here actually recording episode is I was going to go trick-or-treating and I was going to dress up as Luigi, who unfortunately is not in Super Mario 64. But um, yeah, I was going to go trick-or-treating as him for the second year in a row. But... I just tried on my costume, and apparently it does not fit anymore. I must have gained a lot of weight, just like Mario. Uh, I do have a Mario costume, but I think that might not fit. And even if it did, I just, I really don't think I would go as him. Because, um, before I went as Luigi last year for Halloween, I actually went as Mario for three straight years. That is how much I used to love Mario. I mean... I love Mario now, he's awesome, but like, just, I'm not as obsessed with him now as I was before. Hang on, I'll be right back, okay? I just, I, I might have to cut this, I just need to go check something, alright? Okay, I'm back. Um, I don't know. I, I thought I heard like, someone coming up the driveway for like trick-or-treating or... Like, my mom coming home. Like, <laughs> the only reason I don't do this around when my, parent, my parents are, like, in the next room or anything is just, like, they might come in and talk to me and, or talk to me about stuff, personal stuff about my life, and I just don't want anyone to hear that. Or, I don't know, I just think parents embarrass, you know, like kids or say stuff and interrupt their things. I don't know. I, I, I honestly don't. 
Oh, uh, what the frick am I doing right now? I've already gotten this star. See what happens when you get sidetracked on commentary? Don't do it. Don't be like me. Trust me. You don't want to be me. Uh... Okay, so what are we looking for? Oh, okay. We're still doing that one where we gotta shoot the cannon. Oh, no. I don't want to do that. By the way, I'd like to say that I know that I don't have the best quality camera, but this is what I got for Christmas. I don't know what it is. I think it's like a Toshiba. Some kind of small Toshiba video camcorder, whatever. And it's... All I got. So, you're just gonna have to deal with it. If you don't like it, whatever. Who cares? Uh, but, you know, maybe in the future, if I get a job or maybe get some money or something, then I'll. I will definitely um, get a new camera. But, in the meantime, I'm pretty sure this is okay. Oh, so close. Did you, come on, you gotta admit, that was a lot better than last time. Uh, my grandma, my grandma's watching Family Feud upstairs, just to let you know in case you hear some sound or from somewhere else. And um, she probably doesn't even know that I'm recording right now, so she probably thinks I'm talking to myself right now. Oh man, that'd be hilarious. Oh. Uh, all right. Um, so we finally got that star, man. Hang on. Uh, I need to go check something again. Okay, this time, it'll be the last time. Alright, let me go. Alright guys, I'm back. Uh, is you know, same issue. Hmm. Oh, wait, hang on a second. Let me eat a yonk peppermint patty. Well, you can listen to me eat it myself and be starved. I mean, I don't think you could hear that, but... But these things are pretty tasty if you've never tasted them before. They're pretty good. And by the way, you might be wondering why this light has just appeared on this carpet. Well, if you look up into the light, you can actually enter a secret level. I mean, isn't that awesome? Mario's flying. What ability do you think this is? Well, just like I said earlier in my playthrough, this is the wing cap where Mario has the ability to fly. I mean, let me just say that, in my opinion, I love Mario 64, but I really think the flying controls in this game are really fucked up. Because that's what I think. I don't know. I don't know what you think, but that's just what I think. And if you think different, well, then whatever. I'll let you have your opinion. Oh my god, you do not know how hard that is to do that. To get all the red coins in this, it is extremely hard. Alright, so we now we just um, stepped on the caps, wing cap switch, and we have unlocked the wing cap ability. And wouldn't you know it, we also got a star. I'd say I'm doing pretty good in this uh, episode. Wouldn't you say, wouldn't you think? Yeah, so anyways, the reason I haven't been posting much is because of school. Man, um, well, that's pretty much it. But I have other stuff to do. But it's, mo it's mostly just school and soccer. Yeah. But, you know, I didn't sign up to go trick or tree, so I had some free time now. Yeah, it was fun. Yeah, you know, I mean, not f what was fun? <laughs> I'm acting like I actually went trick or tree after I just said I'm not going trick or treating. But if you if you do go trick or treating, um, well that's good. Um, get a lot of candy, or if again, oh, I'm set. Okay, I'm not thinking straight. Let me just stop moving. Let me just focus on commentating. Um, yeah. So if you did get a lot of candy, um, that's good. Um, but here's a tip of advice: do not preserve that candy as long as you can, because every time I get candy, it's gone by December. Most people can actually save it up to February. 
But it all depends, I mean, it all depends on how much candy you have, but it also depends on how eager you are to eat the candy. And I am very eager. Oh, Mario fell asleep waiting for us. Yeah, so, um, if you didn't know, this is something you can do in the game. If you wait too long, Mario falls asleep, and, well, I mean, that's all he does. But if you wait a little longer, he lies down, and he starts humming, um, uh, foods to himself. Anyways, let me check how much there is to the video. Oh, 60 minutes. Ah. Well, uh, this episode seemed a little short, and I hate to cut this off, but I have a life, you know. And Mario has four. So yeah, that's that. Um, but don't worry, I will see you next episode, and um, happy Halloween. I'm the one and only Bumpericks, and I will see you next time.